Straight to breaking news this noon, a death investigation. Sky 6 Live over a neighborhood where deputies have a home blocked off. And thanks for joining us. I'm Bridget Ellison. And I'm Justin Mormont. The details are still coming in on this, but we do know investigators are at a home along Alexander Avenue for a death investigation. It's off Airport Boulevard, just north of H.E. Thomas Jr. Parkway in the Sanford area. News 6's Catherine Silver live in that neighborhood. What can you tell us, Catherine? Hi guys, I'm standing at the corner of Alexander and 20th where the sheriff's office has the road closed. You can see behind me they've got about a block of Alexander shut down to traffic where this remains an active investigation this afternoon. We want to show you what it looks like from above. This is some video that just came into our newsroom from Sky 6 within the last hour. We have been watching deputies go in and around a home here. They have crime scene tape up in the front yard. They are not telling us much at this point beyond the fact that they are referring to whatever happened here as a suspicious death investigation. Now, we first started asking questions when we learned the 417 was closed near Lake Jessup earlier this morning. Deputies tell us there is also an ongoing death investigation by the bridge there. They believe it is a suicide. That call did come in first before 9 o'clock this morning. I did ask a spokesperson for the sheriff's office if these two investigations are connected. I'm told they cannot confirm that at this point. I'm also told the sheriff is headed to this scene, and once he gets here and is briefed, he may be able to tell us more information. We'll pass along any updates as soon as we get them. For now, I'm live in Seminole County. Catherine Silver, getting results, News 6.